As I said, hips all the way. Oh, hello. Hello, who are you? Are you letting me go? And she just left. Why is she helping me? Is she a prisoner too? I'll, I'll gladly be your friend though. Um... Yeah, I don't know what to pick. She grabbed me. She doesn't want- Greta doesn't want you to touch her hands! Bro, shoot. I did not mean for that. Game over. Alessa is dead and it's your fault. What? Hug? Greta doesn't like hugs! Alright, fine. I'll just kiss her on the cheek. Fine. Kiss Greta on her cheek. She's blushing. Oh. Greta seems more friendly now. Thank you, friend. Oh. <laughs> she doesn't answer, but it seems she's blushing. Okay, I... Uh, okay, I, I'm a little scared but <laughs> of how that... Of the two other ones, but I, I don't know. <laughs> There's a white dress on a mannequin. No, uh, would you like to take it? I think I can now, if she's gonna be more friendly to me. Is it okay if I take it, Greta? Oh. <laughs> Thank you. But the third slot. There you go. Hi. Oh, oh. <laughs> Tell her to escape with you. Kill her. Do nothing. I don't want to kill her. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, I'll tell her to escape with me. Go with me. Let's escape together. Greta accepts and she will escape with you. Oh, nice. <laughs> hey, we're following. Okay. Okay, I want to think that Greta will like protect me <laughs> once I leave with her. Alright, let's go. Oh, we just went to my house. Okay. <laughs> All right. I contacted the police, so we sh we should have news soon. Don't worry. You won't have to go back there. We'll start a new life together. Oh. <laughs> anyway, let's take a shower. That should relax us. You're gonna take a, sh a shower together? Oh. Wow. Okay. They actually did. Huh. <laughs> I mean, with all those hearts, I guess I should have expected them to like each other. I just- <laughs> I'm just gonna shower her, okay. Huh. I- I- am I just fixing myself or something? Oh my goodness, hello. Oh no, why do you have a knife? Why? <laughs> Greta, why- what are you doing with that knife? Um. Um. No, why? I trusted her! <laughs> Damn, what? <laughs> Yes. Ending friendship. Hmm? God. <laughs> yeah, I, I didn't expect Greta to just suddenly kill me. <laughs> no, um, actually, I think that wasn't her. I mean, yes, it is her, but. Okay, I still know that the diaries that she has are not naughty side, like another her. So maybe that was the one that just killed me, but god damn, nah, I just got killed. <laughs> My, my Greta, I, I, I like her. I, I, I trusted her. I may mean, still trust her now, but oh no, damn. So I can't have an ending with her uh, with me. I'm sorry, Greta. Please don't hate me for this. I'm sorry. Jesus, I, I just shot her in the face. No, god damn it. She's dead. You go. Oh, that's my car. Jack. What? Oh, it's Greta. Oh shoot. No, Jack just freaking died. And Greta. Greta, no, it can't be. I killed you. She looks different. We're dangerous. The holy candle protects me from Bob, not not his family. I have to get away from Greta. 
Get away, get in your car, escape by foot, or face your death. What? Oh! Oh, well, okay, I chose to get caught. Oh, uh, okay, she's kissing me and she rolled. Damn. And she's, <laughs> she's still smiling, okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, wait, Greta. Greta? Uh, Alyssa, I'm sorry. I never wanted to hurt you. He's the one who makes us hurt others. He has control over our actions. Your father, Mr. Bob? He is not my father. We're not a family. My mother and my brothers, they're not my family either. What? Each of us, at one point in our lives, made a deal with Mr. Bob. The twins are actually 40 years old. Just like you, I was once a kid who hated her parents and wished for a new house and a new family. Then Mr. Bob appeared and I went with him. He turned me into this, into a monster. Oh no, Greta. I was seven, but now I'm 22. I've been trapped uh, all this time. Yeah, that document too was for her. Damn. The same happened to the mother and the twins. We're all victims of Mr. Bob. What about the house? He fixed the house at random and transforms them. House 446 was not the first and it certainly won't be the last. Greta, I'm sorry. I didn't know any of this, and I blew your head with a shotgun. But I'm glad you came back though. I mean, yeah, your other half is trying to kill me, but... I think you're a really sweet girl, and there's good inside of you. Honestly, you don't look like a monster to me. You're pretty. Oh. <laughs> Thank you, I think you're pretty too. Uh, <laughs> okay, yeah, I, as I said, I wanted these two to <laughs> like each other. Oh. Listen, there must be a way to stop Mr. Bob and for real and turn you back into a human. I would like to help you find it, but my evil half has taken control of me in the, mater in the material world. I can only communicate with you through this world. What is this place? I feel like I've seen- I've been here before. I'm not sure. It seems only those who encountered Mr. Bob can come here. Listen, I'm going to find a way to defeat Mr. Bob and save you all. Also, Alyssa, please be careful. He has taken you into his new house. Scene? Wait, just a chase scene. Oh. Okay. Run! Ah! Greta, no! Please! No, please! I don't want ah! <laughs> ah! Please! Don't kill me! No, I'm at the wrong way! Please! Greta disappeared. Greta? Are you trying to resist Mr. Bob's control so you won't hurt me? Aww. <laughs> she really loves you. They really love each other. I know from Greta. Dear Alessa, I managed to take control of my body for a few seconds and write this note. Take a nap on my sofa so we can talk. Okay. Oh, I found a broom. I guess I'm gonna go to sleep. Yeah. Hey, Greta. Alasa, you came. I missed you. I missed you too. I missed you too, Greta. Aw. <laughs> you want to tell me something? Did you find a way to defeat Mr. Bob and turn you back into a human? Uh, y yes, listen. Have you ever heard of Zagara Zagarakatal? Zagarakatal? No, who's that? No? Sagar Katal is an ancient deity more powerful than Mr. Bob, capable of destroying the world in seconds. However, Sagar Katal has been asleep for millions of years. There are cults dedicated to Sagar Katal all over the world. Mr. Bob is actually an ancient demonic entity created by Sagar Katal. So he's like Mr. Bob's boss or father? Sort of, I guess. But you see, although Zagarakata is sleeping, you can still reach him and offer him something in exchange for his help. Wait, does that mean that? You can speak to Zagarakata in his dreams and ask him to eliminate Mr. Bob and turn us back into humans. However, you must keep in mind of the following. You must carry out a ritual and you will need certain items. You will have to give Zagarakata something precious to you. I see. What are those items? You need the skull of a baby, a blood jar, a relic known as the Ring of Zagarakatal. Apparently, you can find those items in the house, but I don't know where their location. After you find them, come to me. 
I see. I still have to search then. Thanks for the information, Greta. I'll find him and I will save you. Please be careful. The, mo the mother and the twins aren't the only dangerous in the house. Oh. <laughs> she was able to help me. Okay. In Greta and the bunnies. Turn us into bunnies and transport us to a nice house somewhere far away. How strange, but if that's what you want. Oh. Hey, <laughs> we're bunnies. <laughs> Alyssa and Greta embrace their new existence as bunnies. They lived in a beautiful house cabin in the forest for years until they died of natural causes. Mr. Bob is still in the house waiting for Alyssa. He has no idea what happened. <laughs> <laughs> Yay, GF says bunnies. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Ending two <laughs> bunnies. Nice. Hey. Greta. Oh, that's what you did. I'm a human again. I recovered my tongue. Were you always this pale? Yes, you don't like it? I... Oh. <laughs> Is it cool? Yeah. <laughs> I love you just the way you are. I love you, Greta, just the way you are. Aww. <laughs> oh, Alessa, I love you too. Have achieved your goals, Bob has to go to sleep. I will claim what you offer. Unless you want to change your offer. No, I can... I can get back on you, Tom. You offered your tongue. I shall take it. Well... Man. I don't have a tongue anymore. Okay. It's okay, Alessa. I know it's hard. When I got my tongue removed, it was also hard for me. But now we have each other, and I promise I'll take care of you. Greta, as long as you hold me, I will be happy no matter what. No. I love you, Alessa. I love you too, Greta. 